right, let's see if we can kind of explain what we're going to be doing here. We're going to be talking about Doodle Bob. Doodle Bob is a character from SpongeBob series, or episode, I should say. And it's also something that we've put together here as a simple illustration of a character that's made out of a box. Box modeling is a process of starting out with a four-sided polygon, adding segments, and then using some simple mechanisms such as extrude and bevel to create a shape that's akin to whatever it is you want to make. We box modeled a jet in about week two of 3ds Max. And as we get into the idea of building a character, a very simple character, and rigging them to be able to put them into a game engine, we're going to use Doodle Bob, Ahoy Minoy and all, and to, uh, to illustrate this idea. The animation trees in the Epic Game Engine are something that we'll get into later, but just so that we again continue this process of we create our own content and we use it as a, as a way to learn all the concepts and we'll better appreciate what's going on. So here's a demonstration in effect of creating Doodle Bob from the past. I'm going to do a bit of a speed run through it just to kind of oh, highlight some of the things that are going on. Um, we talked about a couple of different types of virtual studios. One of them that we did already was one to show off our work, almost like a photography studio. What we're going to use this time is going to be more like a modeling studio. We're going to set up a couple of uh, pieces of geometry to hold a background. And then I've, I've pre-built basically a template for you, a pelt in effect of, of a UV character that we can use. And you can customize it a little bit. Uh, in 3ds Max, we'll be building a box, adding some segments, and then we'll be doing some series of operations to basically create the limbs out of this very simple character. So things we've done in the past, including extrude, bevel, and we're not looking for a great amount of detail here. We're looking for a very simple think stick figure art, just proof of concept. We're going to go back and forth in our material editor to make sure that we can then do a very simple UV map on this boxy shape and end up with what looks like a character with some arms and legs. Very similar to what we did when we were UV wrapping for our plane project in like week three of 3ds Max. So we're spiraling through some of those same concepts we've already done. The step-by-step -step in the PowerPoint along with this video will help you get to a point where you're ready then to export this creation. And then we're going to actually harness the power of something that's been made available through our Creative Cloud Suite. We're going to actually take this object and bring it into Mixamo, where we could buy some, not buy, we could set up some pre-built animations. So here's Patrick being auto-rigged, and then there's Doodle Bob being auto-rigged. So the students should all have their own version of their Doodle Bob character in a video game. In fact, there's an Unreal-based game done using the I got a student project that shows off Doodle Bob. You know, he's it's a platformer and he's trying to jump from position to position, avoiding gravity with a reset, and he collects the different parts to build his own magic pencil. So that's just an introduction of what we're gonna do. We're gonna feather in and out of this project as we cover those concepts in a little more detail, but I just wanted to set the stage and let you know what we are gonna be doing. Hope it's going well. Remember to attend the conferences because the videos I make are never a substitute for the interaction. All right. Hope you're having a great day. And uh, I know I got to stop my video. Great magic pencil, your powers are too mighty for us ocean dwellers. So I will send you back to the magic kingdom from where you came. We rejoin the artist in a creative slump. Huh? What's, what's this? My pencil! <laughs> oh.
thought Yeah, I'm came jumping around it though. <laughs> I'm gonna be the first person to beat the game legit then. Dog! You serious? Yes. No way! I hate Andrew. I did it, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Only one cheat. I give up. <laughs> It wasn't a cheat, it was I'm a strategy. You know Breakfast for my favorite pet snail. Full steam ahead, the SSI am ready is about to set sail. This cat day couldn't get much better, but it keeps on trying. Yeah, I'm on my way. Somewhere there's a Krabby Patty that needs frying.